is Bookmark Monday, and joining me from Cicada Books and Coffee is the owner, Don Hilbert, with some reading ideas, perfect for fall, and of course, Halloween. You all have a lot going on this month, so thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for having me. Yes, and we're looking at some of these. You can see some of these lists here. I know that this author was just here, your Erie Appalachia. He was. He came and mm -hmm. signed some copies of his book. That, that has been our most popular uh, book this year. We have sold more copies of that than anything. Really? And but you do still have a few. We do have shop. a few now, and we will mm -hmm. have more when we when we sell the signed copies. Uh huh. And I love this one, Sweet as Sin, all about candy. And this is the month we're all <laughs> stocking up on candy and eating candy. Um, you just have like a good selection there too. Yeah, that is uh, a book club pick for this month. And you know, candy is Halloween themed. It if is. You think about trick or treat. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, so you have book clubs, you have all kinds of things. So uh, before we get to the actual clubs, what are some of the books that you're recommending for, for people looking for a good read this time of year? Well, if I start with the, with the youngest readers, the mm -hmm. R.L. Stein from Goosebumps has got, two, we have two collections of short stories mm -hmm. um, for younger readers, and this one as well. This is a local author, A.B. Hooser, and it is a paranormal um, sort of action adventure book oh, for young adults. Shade of Winter. This is a local author, a friend of the stores. Okay. Um, who just did a reading and a signing and we have copies of that. Okay. Any others that you really like? Uh, this one I'm looking forward to. I haven't started this one yet. Mm -hmm. This is new. This is this is a very um, uh, popular book right now. This just came out, Black Sheep, a, a family mm -hmm. story about going home when possibly you shouldn't. <laughs> Uh, that sounds uh, very intriguing there. I yes. like that. Black Sheep by Rachel Harrison. And um, what is this one? Well, we normally keep Blind Date with a Book uh -huh. books in our store, which are wrapped, and we give you a very, very brief description. And so they're for you to take home and open when you need a good read, and then it'll be a surprise. I so like these, that are all, idea. these are all horror themed books. Ooh. So this is our After Hours Library. Okay. So you have several book clubs and events so what's uh, coming up this month we do um, so based on a book uh, is on October 18th mm -hmm. and the and the book this month is Dracula which is a classic oh. but there is a new film coming out mm -hmm. I think it just released okay um, the last voyage of the Demeter which is part of the Dracula lore uh -huh. which is why we're reading Dracula um, so you have well you've got several book clubs so this is your book club where it's based it's a movie but right. You, but it's for books yes. for which there is a TV show or a film. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's a great idea. Okay. What else you have? And then Tasty Reads is on October 30th, and that, uh, the book this month is Sweetest Sin, the one we oh, yeah. just looked at, about uh -huh. the history of candy in America and, and Americans' obsession with candy. Yes. We do love our candy, so uh, this looks like a great read. All right. Um, what else do you have? Because you also do, you have some special drinks coming out for fall. We do. We have lots of fall drinks. Um, we have pumpkin pie. Lattes are back, which ah. which everyone waits for. Um, we also have maple pancake, which is a flavor that we keep um, probably six months of the year mm -hmm. because it's so popular, mm -hmm. which is great in a latte. Uh, it's maple flavored. Um, and a new flavor we have that is especially good with tea lattes and uh, some of our herbal teas is caramel apple butter. Oh, I like that. And I'm a tea drinker, so that right. one sounds perfect. It's very good. We have a we have an herbal tea called Autumn Fruit and Flowers, so it's perfect with that. Oh, my gosh. And, and we're looking at these pictures. I mean, these are really wonderful. They really set the tone. Get your book, get your drink, and you're ready for a cozy fall evening. That's right. Yeah. And if you can't choose, then mm -hmm. you can pick up something from the After Hours Library and be surprised. Uh-huh. That is a great idea. Um, how can people find out more and keep up on everything you all are doing there? Oh, well, all of our events um, and and recurring events and book clubs and all the details are on our website. It's so Cicada Books. Way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cicadabooks.com. But you could also follow us on social media. Mm -hmm. That's good. Or just stop in. I mean, it's a great location. And there are two different events um, being held this, this month. Um, 
in Central City in general, mm -hmm. so that would be a good time to come down. There's the Fall Fest and the uh, the Arts Fest, which, okay. is, which is kind of an art walk, but in Central City. Mm -hmm. yep. Well, that is great. You all have our fall planned for us there, again, with great reads, great drinks, and just, you know, some wonderful events to really set the pace there. And um, I lo I'm loving some of these books that you brought in, so I'm already making my list. That's a great Dracula <laughs> cover. <laughs> Don, thanks so much for coming in and sharing some of the fall things you all are doing at Cicada. Thank you. Yeah. Don't go anywhere when we